Well, we made it through seven weeks. Entering the eighth week in the last month of college football, November. November had the games to remember. So how do those games to remember, if you will, how do they start and end as far as I'm concerned? Well, we'll get to it all. And we'll start in the Big 12 Conference, where my heart lies. All this coming up next on the College Football Select Show, Week 8, College Football. Don't go away. College Selection Pick'em Show, everybody. My name's Harry James. The games to remember are played in November. In the NFL, it's December, but here, it's November. And they'll start in the Big 12 at 11 a.m. Okie State tries to continue that win their winning ways in Morgantown at West Virginia on ABC. I'm taking West Virginia in this ballgame. It's, a, it's an 11 a.m. kickoff. I don't know how Oklahoma State's going to feel now. Uh, they slid out of Texas by their chinny-chin-chins. Uh, who knows how the mullet, the shirtless mullet, uh, powers out in this one. So I'm taking the uh, the other side. I'm taking Olgerson in West Virginia. Speaking of Texas... At 11 a.m., they tried to bounce back after the gut-wrenching losses to Oklahoma State and Oklahoma. On ESPNU, they will be at Baylor. Texas at Baylor ESPNU. I'm taking the horns. 2 p.m., Kansas State is at Kansas on FS1. I'm taking Kansas State in this ballgame. Uh, 2.30 on e ABC or ESPN2, uh, depending on your coverage. Uh, the game of the Big 12, TCU and West and Iowa State in Ames. I I'm taking TCU, but look for Iowa State to keep this thing interesting. They've played well against Oklahoma and Tech the last few weeks. Speaking of Oklahoma and Tech, at 7 o'clock, uh, prime time, ABC, Oklahoma, or ABC and ESPN2, I guess, depending on your coverage again, Texas Tech and Oklahoma. Um, the, uh, the prime time game, I don't pick this thing. I'm, not, I'm staying away from this as far away from it as I can, so I don't sound like a homer, because if not, I'd probably pick Oklahoma all the time. So I'm going to stay away from it. Uh, other than that, on Thursday night, uh, you'll see, at 6 o'clock, you'll see Eastern Michigan at Northern Illinois on ESPNU. I'm going to go with you and I. Toledo and Ball State on the 3. That's ESPN 3. Also at 6 o'clock, I'm going to take Toledo. 6.30 on the U, ESPNU. South Alabama at Georgia Southern. I'm taking Georgia Southern on ESPNU. At 8 o'clock, on ESPN, Stanford at Oregon State. I'm taking Stanford, the Cardinal. Friday night, Tulane will be at Memphis on CBS Sports. I'm taking Memphis, Florida State, and Boston College. Also, that one's on ESPNU in Boston at Boston College. I'm taking BC. Uh, 8 o'clock, our brethren to the north, the Hurricane of Tulsa. We'll be down in Dallas at SMU on ESPN2. I'm taking the Methodist Ponies. Get your omelets earlier than usual on Saturday. Because there's a game at 10.30. That's when you'll find Buffalo at Akron on CBS Sports Network. I'm taking Akron. The normal 11 o'clock kickoffs. Uh, ESPN will have Wisconsin at Illinois. I'm taking the Badgers. Miami will be at North Carolina. I'm taking Miami. Uh, Michigan tries to bounce back 
as they host Rutgers. Rutgers at Michigan on the Big Ten Network. I'm going to go with Michigan. And the SEC Network, Arkansas, will be at Ole Miss on the SEC Network. I'm taking the Ole Miss Red Ales. 11-20, Louisville tries to take that big time win over Florida State and take that momentum, but they got to do it on the road at Wake Forest on ACC Network. I'm taking Louisville. Uh, 11:30, Virginia at Pitt on the ACC Network. Pitt's trying to fi- start to find themselves a little bit. I'm taking Pitt at home. The Pac-12 Network will have Cal Berkeley or California at Colorado on the Pac-12 Network. I'm taking Colorado. At 1.30, the Stadium Network will have Florida International at Marshall. I'm taking Marshall. And at 2 p.m., there's two more games before the next primetime slot. And that's Air Force at Colorado State. I'm taking on the CBS Sports Network. I'm taking Colorado State. And San Jose State at Brigham Young on the three ESPN3. I'm taking Brigham Young. The next of the premier games at 2.30 on Fox National. Penn State at B, Ohio State University. I'm taking Ohio State. The uh, Georgia-Florida cocktail party. CBS Sports on CBS. I'm taking Georgia. On uh, the Mirror ESPN ABT, ABC game is UCLA at Washington. I'm taking Washington, the Huskies. NBC will have NC State at Notre Dame. As usual, the Notre Dame game. So you got to go with Notre Dame. Michigan State at Northwestern on ESPN. I'm taking Michigan State. Georgia Southern will be at Troy on the ESPN3. I'm taking uh, Troy. App State at at University of Massachusetts on the new 11 network. I'm taking Appalachian State. And on the new Flow network, Louisiana Tech at Rice. I'm taking La Tech. The final game of that slot, Indiana and Maryland at Maryland. On the Big Ten Network, I'm taking Maryland. 245, Houston will be at South Florida on ESPNU. I'm taking South Florida. 3 o'clock, Vandy will be at South Carolina on the SEC Network. I'm taking South Carolina. Uh, 3.30, Florida Atlantic will be at Western Kentucky on the Stadium Network, the new Stadium Network. I'm taking Western Kentucky. 4 o'clock, Prairie View will be at Central Florida. On CBS Sports, on ESPN3, I'm taking uh, Central Florida. And Louisiana Monroe will be at Idaho, also on ESPN3. I'm taking Idaho. Uh, 445, Utah will be at Oregon. On the Pac-12 network, I'm taking the Oregon Ducks. 5 o'clock, Texas State will be at Coastal Carolina on ESPN3. I'm taking Coastal Carolina. 530, Minnesota will be at Iowa. On FS1, I'm taking Iowa. Uh, Missouri will be at UConn in non-conference play on CBS Sports Network. I'm taking uh, Connecticut. And Old Dominion will be at our old buddy Seth Luttrell and North Texas, the former OU fullback. That one's on ESPN3. Two wins, and he goes to a bowl. I think this is one of the two wins that he needs for North Texas. 6 o'clock, Alabama-Birmingham. Uh, we'll be at Southern Mississippi on Conference USA TV. I'm going to go with uh, South, Southern Miss. 615 ESPN will have Mississippi State at Texas A&M, the Aggies. I'm taking A&M. Uh, 620 Duke will be at Georgia Tech on the SEC Network. I'm taking Georgia Tech. And on the Big Ten Network, Nebraska will be at Purdue on the uh, Big Ten Network. I'm taking Purdue. ESPNU will have New Mexico at Wyoming. I'm taking Wyoming and Tennessee at Kentucky on the SEC Network. I'm taking Kentucky. The final primetime slot game at 7 o'clock opposite of Oklahoma Tech will be Georgia Tech at Clemson, ESPN2 or ABC. I'm taking Clemson. Uh, UTEP and Texas El Paso will be on Conference USA Network or TV at the same time. I'm taking UTSA. And on ESPN3, you can see Arizona State at New Mexico State. I'm taking New Mexico State. 8.30, the, uh, the Pride and Leeches, Washington State, will be at Arizona on the Pac-12 Network. I'm taking Arizona. Uh, 9 o'clock on the new AT&T Sports Network. You'll see UNLV at Fresno. 
I'm taking Fresno State. CBS Sports will have Boise State at Utah State on CBS Sports Network. I'm going to take Boise State. 945 USC will be at the other Arizona, Arizona State on ABC, ESPN. I'm taking Southern Cal. At 915, the final game of the night, San Diego State will be at Hawaii on ESPN2. I'm taking San Diego State. All right, guys, as usual, don't take any of these picks to Vegas. But um, if you do, I'm willing to take the cash for it. All right, guys. Uh, my name is Harry James. You can find me on on uh, Facebook, Harry James Taylor. You can also uh, find these videos on YouTube, Boomer Sooner 1982, or you can find me on Twitter, Twitter at Hype Man Harry. All right, guys. Thanks for watching and enjoy this week of college football. Thanks for watching. I'm out of here.